Well, we all know Halloween is just around the corner, but guests at the Arboretum's Haunted Trail in Brainerd didn't know what might be lurking around the corner tonight. Sarah Winkleman has the spooky details. It was a night full of spooks, thrills, and chills as Brainerd community members took a walk on the Haunted Trail. Oh, we love Halloween, so we've been coming here every year since the kids were little, and yeah, it's just become a tradition. In its now 14th year, there is an alternative low scare route for parents with young children or those with a low scare tolerance. And then if you choose to take the side loops that are labeled high scare, then be prepared to have the pants scared off of you. The low scare options are really fun. Uh, they're still scary. They're still Halloween. The trail first starts off with some ghosts floating in the trees and then moves on for the next mile with many more surprises in store monsters and go blood and guts and who knows what because each group gets to do their own thing. A group of nearly 250 volunteers staged their own scary scenes to perform on the trail. Like Mackenzie and her mom who were acting out a science experiment gone wrong with some crazy makeup. The way you do this is like with layers of Kleenex and then this is like some sort of copper wire. I'm not really sure what it is. It's sharp. Um, and then you just kind of like poke it through and it's attached to a spirit gum and then just a lot of black and red makeup. It's a spooktacular event that encourages getting outdoors. There is something creepy in the woods, so uh, we, we think it's a lot of fun just to amp it up a little bit and scare for fun and you know, believe it or not, you're still walking a mile, so you're still getting exercise in the great north woods. With a variety of sounds in the woods, you just never know what to expect. I love hearing the kids out in the woods laughing and joking and having a ball setting up their seams and then the scaring during the night. It's wonderful. It's a night full of... <laughs> Reporting in Brainerd, Sarah Winkleman, Lakeland News. The annual Haunted Trail will be opening in tomorrow night from 7 until 9 p.m. Looks a little too scary for me. Looks good, Dennis. Good I'll, I'll, I'll take yeah. you. Yeah, yeah. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.